Hi everyone, I'm Claudia Oliver and I'm with today, um, I'm sitting in London with Dr. Kate Stone, whom I met yesterday at the TED auditions here in London. Hi Kate, how are you? Hi, I'm good, thanks. So tell me a little bit about yourself. Okay, so I'm Dr. Kate Stone from um, Cambridge in the UK. My background is I studied electronics and then I did a PhD in physics. Um, but then I kind of discovered printing and I absolutely love printing and the idea that Everything could be made by print, made by machines in high volume. Um, but so much of print doesn't do very much because of everything that we, we use that has electronics in it. So what I've done is combine the best of print and the best of electronics um, and made pieces of print come to life. So making print interactive. So something like a tissue carton could also be a piano. So as well as having the tissues, the kids can play with it and kind of have fun. And I've made this piano colour coded so anyone can play piano and you can download new tunes from the internet because there's this little tear off tab there that kind of has the tunes on it for you. So um, there's a lot of practical uh, applications for it, really. I mean, you know, it, it seems to be something that is, is very useful. Yeah, either practical or just making things fun, but most, most of all, just making things interactive. So this is a poster. Okay. And when you touch different parts of the poster, it makes different DJ sound effects. So you kind of hear the air horn, bah, bah, bah. <laughs> 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 But it's printed on a big printing press, which is the same that's used to print Lady Gaga posters, Twilight New Moon posters, and we just print conducted inks, stick a bit of electronics on it, and now the poster is interactive. So you can make all sorts of things like that. We've also made pharmaceutical cartons that know when you're taking your tablets and not, and they remind you, help you when to take it, but they also let the doctor know whether you took your medication when you said you did or or you, you know, you haven't. Um, and we've also connected pieces of paper to the internet. So you could print a real world Facebook like button or touch stuff and it would send tweets and updates to Facebook depending on what you touch. So I believe in the not too distant future, we'll wake up and all the technology we're used to seeing around us will have gone, but it will be in everything. All of the things that are around us will be interactive. You'll be able to touch the wall and do a gesture and make the lights change whatever or just not it's up to you whether you want to use it or not but everything is going to change and it's going to change through combining print and electronics and a whole load of creativity so the future is now the future is now yeah I and mean, i heard someone say that earlier on this week the future is now but it's just not widely distributed we're going to change that <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much i'm claudia oliver bye